I have um, floated the canyon to the Rio Grande with Ann Richards. I've run the Devil's River. I grew up on the Brazos. I work every day at the second largest spring in the Western United States. And all of these places are precious to me. The biggest issue facing uh, freshwater in Texas is the fact that we're gonna have twice as many people in the next 50 years, and we have already given permission for more water to be, be withdrawn from most of our rivers than is actually in them. That means that if all the water rights that the state has allocated since we were a colony of Spain were actually utilized, the many of our most iconic rivers would be dry today, and yet we've got to find water for twice as many people in the next half century. Oftentimes, uh, when I, when I uh, speak or appear at various places and quote all of the dire statistics about the environmental problems we face, someone will stand up and say, well, what can I do? You know, what, what can a person like me, who's a school teacher or a lawyer or an accountant, what can I do to help address this problem? Every one of us during the course of a year can take a child outdoors, can put a child in the water, teach them how to fish, take them canoeing, but expose them to the out of doors so that they understand that it is a source of fun and enjoyment of spiritual renewal, but it's also something that they must take responsibility for.